Hey, Teresa. Yeah, I got out of work early, so Gustavo's doing something special for dinner. Favor? Yeah, sure. Chickens? Seriously? Okay. Sure. You just have to promise to pick them up within an hour because Gustavo's a huge germaphobe, he's really mad about the rats, and chickens are stinky. Okay. Okay. Yep, happy to do it. Okay, see you soon. Bye. Lucky I was nearby when you oh, called. Do me a favor, promise. Yeah, I promise. Gustavo I promise. will kill me. I promise. I just have to prep the car okay. and then get ready to take the, take them and some other animals I'm going to pick up later. Okay. okay. Where are you going? The sanctuary? Yes. Okay. Two chickens? Oh, it'll be a lot easier for so, you. Oh, yeah, just two, Teresa. That's Sweet. great. Come on, let's go. Okay. I can't believe I let you talk me into doing this. this? I don't know. It wasn't here when I left. Oh my goodness, look. Hi, Lila. It's Judy. I was just calling to see how everything was going with Mrs. Garrett or Mrs. G. Mm. Are you getting the facts of life all together? <laughs> no, it'll take a few days. Don't worry, darling. I'm sure everything will turn out perfectly. No, no. No problem. All right, sweetie. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Should I? Mm -hmm. I would. Looks like he's not mad at you anymore. We have to get the chickens out of here. You have to leave and I have to leave. What? He can't know that we were here. What about the chickens? Uh, one hour. Hmm? He can't find out. Oh, he'll never find out. Help me get them into the bathroom. Okay. It won't fit. Oh, what do you mean it won't fit? It's too big. Ah, oh, what are we gonna do? Oh gosh, God. let's just toss him in there. Toss the chickens out. Oh, okay. Paws crossed. We'll be back in an hour. Oh God. Okay. Come on. All right, chickens. Tell us your name and who you foster. I'm Nadine and I foster Mrs. G. Okay, uh, have you ever fostered before? No, she's my first foster. And how does it work out with your lifestyle? Seamlessly. Not, I, I don't feel like my routine has changed much, but there's just something more. Um, not something more to do, but something more to enjoy. There's an extra company, an extra presence. And you fostered her for how long? I've had her for about three months now. Okay. And does there seem to be a feeling of wanting to keep her or you, you really feel like you're just doing it for fostering for temporary and then she's going to move on? No, I, I love her. I, go, I know I'm going to be really sad when she finds her forever home um, and I'm slowly trying to work out if it's possible that I could be her forever home because I can't bear the thought of parting, but I think she'll make a family very, very happy, whether it's mine or someone else's. <laughs> Please tell us about Ready for Rescue, where Mrs. G is from. So Ready for Rescue is a New York-based rescue organization um, that fosters, or that 
rescues dogs and cats, and its mission is to end kill shelters in New York State. Um, Excellent. So we rescue animals from other kill sh from kill shelters or from other shelters that just have overflow or other rescue organizations um, or just strays that people find. Um, and it's all volunteer based. It's all foster home based. There's no like physical shelter. Um, and you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Pet Finder, or at readyforrescue.org. Thank you so much for watching. We really, really, really appreciate everyone that fosters animals. Mrs. Garrett is available for adoption. You can find her at foreverhomeseries.com and readyforrescue.com. Thanks. For information about any of the animals that you've seen in our web series, Forever Home, please go to our website at www.foreverhomeseries.com.